so much for the Ghost of Christmas Past. Telcom TV's very own Ghost of Christmas Future, Ian Scales, spoke to the Yankee Group's Camille Mindler to hear her thoughts on what to expect in 2009. Well, I think that 2009's an interesting year for a couple of reasons. I think you have to be a, a student of history to appreciate some of the ironies, perhaps. It's uh, the 150th anniversary of The Origin of the Species, the publication by Charles Darwin. And I think what he said about, you know, survival of the fittest and, um, you know, the selection process applies in the communications market as well. And it comes down to uh, three things. One is adaptability to change. Uh, another one is the ability to collaborate with partners and others. Yes. And the third is raw intuition linked to your ability and desire to experiment. I think those are the three things that are going to tell us whether people are going to survive or not. So I know you've been interested in, in developments like Bharti in India where they've outsourced just about everything. Do you think that's a model that we're going to see in the rest of the world following a bit more closely in future? Not only do I think it's a model that we're going to see more of, I think it's absolutely indispensable to survival, I think that more and more service providers, whether they're fixed-based, mobile, or in integrated, have to redefine the core and they have to go virtual. I mean, I've analyzed what more than 300 service providers have done across the world in terms of externalization. And there are some very key examples. It's not just the Barty Airtels. You should look at what KPN has been doing, um, BT has been doing, um, even Deutsche Telekom has been doing through sale and leaseback deals involving the transfer of many thousands of people to people like Nokia Siemens Networks. There's a lot of activity of externalization and there's going to be more.